everything that's been going on in the last couple of weeks, couple of months, I decided today that I want to issue a challenge, a challenge of positivity. This challenge is called the I Got You Challenge. Now, I Got You is a song, of course, performed by yours truly that revolves around friendship and family and those who have had your back. But today, I want you to do something special for a random stranger. Do something special for anybody. You see an elderly lady crossing the street, help her. You see somebody who might need help with groceries, help them. Do something good for somebody today because we all need it. Good day everyone, I hope this message finds you well. My name is Josh Gardner, I'm Tegan Management for Ricardo Drew. On the 12th of December 2023, I received a phone call from Ricardo's driver and security at about 11 a.m. saying that he was to pick up Ricardo for an appointment. And when he got to the apartment, he realized that Drew was unresponsive. Within 10 to 15 minutes, I received that message. I arrived at Ricardo's temporary residence at a villa and um, seemed like I had just arrived a couple of minutes after the paramedics. As I entered the premises, I saw Yusuf Michael and the security um, standing outside of the outside of the entrance. I went in, went into the bedroom, and the paramedics were already working on Mr. Drew. Um, they took him out, they put him in the ambulance, and they rushed him to the hospital. After working on him for about, as I said, 45 minutes to an hour, they pronounced Ricardo dead. Um, it's a tough blow to everyone, all his fans, all his support, his family, his closest friends, his management team. Um, anyone who knows you know, he was an amazing person, different light in this world. I um, just want to say thank you to everyone for the amazing support. Everyone has reached out to hundreds of messages, hundreds of calls. Um, the constant playing of his music and his tributes, everybody's personal tributes. We really appreciate it. We really feel the love coming from you guys. So, um, on behalf of this team here, we just want to tell you thank you and just stay tuned for everything that we are planning for him. Um, and we love you. BWO. Hi. No, 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 we absolutely love that. We absolutely love that. Now, for me, because we went there, because we went there, I'm going to just continue with the flow, right? i got to say love going out to Ricardo Drew. I see you guys. He's so, so supportive. He's so supportive, so loving, so caring. Um, tell me about that journey. It's been difficult as always. I mean, relationships has a struggle. Was this thing I see there glistening on this finger? Yeah, on the right finger. Uh -huh. and we're, we're working on on the big day. Right, um, right. But the the relationship is amazing. Uh -huh. It's like watching myself in the mirror. We two goofy <laughs> individuals in one space. That's all I can say. He's a great dad. Uh, phenomenal artist. So big up to Ricardo Drew. Yeah, it's about learning and growing. Mm -hmm. And I mean, it's two different personalities. But it's just compromise and communication. I love most that. Important. Oh. I hope you all guys know that Ricardo Drew managed to make his life a successful journey, even though he died so young. Ricardo's legacy shall forever live on. He always reminded us to be strong, to forgive, and to help one another even to the fact that he even challenged us to do the I got you challenge. He encouraged us to be stronger and spread love across the world. He was known internationally from different countries and this was nothing else but because of his love, dedication to his talent. The man that rose from grass to grace, Ricardo, was such a loving father, a dad and husband material to his baby mama and girlfriend, Patricia Roberts. I hope you can see him fixing the hair of his daughter, how he proposed to his girlfriend. He spoke volumes of kind and lovely words. He documented us a lot of videos and we shall forever remember him. I can't imagine how Patricia feels. Imagine a few hours after she had an interview on Slam 100.5 FM, she sent mega shout outs to Ricardo Drew, not knowing he was somewhere dying. This is sad and heartbreaking, guys. 
I hope you all guys know that Patricia was proposed to. In a heartbreaking Instagram post, Patricia Roberts wrote, I do anything to hear your voice and wake up. Unfortunately, it's nowhere to be heard. There is nothing that we can compare to the loss of a loved one and we cannot say that we know how Patricia Roberts feels right now. None of us knows what she is going through because every death is new. No news is good news. Every time someone passes, you be like, oh God, it feels new each and every time. And all that we have to do is keep on sending prayers and sincere condolence messages to the family and the loved ones, especially Patricia and the kids, as well as his grandma and the parents. To the fans across the world, always listen to his music, share his videos and spread love because he always advocated for love. There is nothing other than kindness and love in this world because it's what each and every person needs. It's what the world needs. Where there is love, there is peace. Where there is kindness, there is love. It's what the world needs. We shall be updating you with more information that shall come in and just stay tuned in. Subscribe to Taj News Media and turn on the bells and we shall keep you posted. I love you guys and stay safe. Bye bye. Everybody has something different, which is why I'm telling the story about it. It's that one day the sun sits here and the sun, one of the floors that I know the pile on the kitchen. I'm going home. Even if I don't sleep, if I have to just do it, I'm going